Today's video is about endangered species, conservation and protection. The term endangered species refers to species that are at risk of extinction due to various factors, including habitat destruction, pollution, poaching, and climate change. The International Union for Conservation of Nature IUCN, maintains the Red List, which assesses the conservation status of species worldwide. The list categorizes species into various threat levels, from least concerned to critically endangered. As of the most recent assessments, thousands of plant and animal species are classified as endangered or critically endangered, emphasizing the severity of the biodiversity crisis facing our planet. The destruction and fragmentation of natural habitats for agriculture, urban development, and infrastructure projects pose a significant threat to many species. As habitats shrink, populations become isolated and more vulnerable to extinction. Altered weather patterns, rising temperatures, and extreme weather events associated with climate change impact ecosystems and disrupt the life cycles of numerous species. Some species may struggle to adapt or relocate to suitable habitats. The illegal trade of wildlife, fueled by demand for exotic pets, traditional medicine, and luxury goods, is a major threat to many endangered species. Poaching has devastating effects on populations, particularly for species with small numbers. Pollution from industrial activities, agriculture, and waste disposal harms both terrestrial and aquatic species. Contaminants in air, water, and soil can have direct and indirect effects on the health and reproduction of organisms. Preserving natural habitats is crucial for the survival of endangered species. Establishing protected areas, wildlife reserves, and corridors helps maintain ecosystems and allows species to thrive. Restoration projects that rehabilitate degraded habitats also contribute to conservation efforts. Governments and international organizations implement laws and regulations to safeguard endangered species. These may include hunting bans, restrictions on habitat destruction, and penalties for illegal trade. Effective enforcement is essential to ensure the success of these measures. Zoos, aquariums, and specialized breeding programs play a vital role in the conservation of endangered species. These efforts involve captive breeding, reintroduction into the wild, and genetic management to maintain healthy populations. Engaging local communities in conservation efforts is key to addressing the root causes of endangerment. Education initiatives raise awareness about the importance of biodiversity, promote sustainable practices, and empower communities to participate in conservation projects. Endangered species often cross borders, requiring international cooperation. Organizations such as the Convention on International Trade in Endangered Species of Wild Fauna and Flora sites, facilitate collaboration among countries to combat illegal trade and protect species at a global level. Several conservation success stories highlight the positive impact of dedicated efforts. The recovery of species like the bald eagle, the black-footed ferret, and the southern white rhinoceros demonstrates that conservation strategies can be effective. However, ongoing challenges, including funding limitations, political obstacles, and the rapid pace of environmental degradation, underscore the need for sustained commitment and innovation in conservation efforts. The conservation and protection of endangered species are fundamental to maintaining the planet's biodiversity and ecological balance. Why are some species considered endangered, and what factors contribute to their decline? Species are classified as endangered when they face a high risk of extinction. The main factors contributing to their decline include habitat loss due to human activities, climate change, pollution, illegal poaching and trade, and disruptions to ecosystems. These threats, often interlinked, pose significant challenges to the survival of many species. How do conservation efforts help endangered species, and what are some common strategies employed? Conservation efforts aim to protect and preserve endangered species. Strategies include creating and maintaining protected habitats, implementing laws and regulations to prevent habitat destruction and illegal trade, conducting captive breeding and reintroduction programs, involving local communities in conservation initiatives, and fostering international collaboration through organizations like SITES. Can captive breeding programs really contribute to the recovery of endangered species, and how do they work? Captive breeding programs play a crucial role in the conservation of endangered species. 
These programs involve breeding and raising individuals in controlled environments, such as zoos or specialized facilities. The goal is to ensure genetic diversity, prevent inbreeding, and potentially reintroduce healthy populations into their natural habitats, thereby bolstering wild populations. What role do local communities play in the conservation of endangered species? Local communities are integral to the conservation of endangered species. Engaging communities in conservation efforts helps address the root causes of endangerment, promotes sustainable practices, and fosters a sense of stewardship for the environment. Community involvement also contributes to the success and longevity of conservation initiatives by ensuring they align with the needs and values of the people living in proximity to endangered species habitats. How can individuals contribute to the protection of endangered species in their daily lives? Individuals can make a significant impact on the protection of endangered species through conscious choices and actions. This includes supporting conservation organizations, practicing responsible tourism, avoiding products derived from illegal wildlife trade, reducing carbon footprint to mitigate climate change effects, and educating others about the importance of biodiversity. By making environmentally conscious decisions, individuals contribute to the broader effort to safeguard endangered species and their habitats. Like the video and remember to subscribe to our channel.